Being back here in Louisiana, as you, it is incredibly meaningful to me. It is the home of my beloved alma mater, Southeastern Louisiana University. I got a chance to visit my cherished old stomping grounds. The school was hit hard by Ida, but in the traditional lion up mentality, they are not letting anything stop SLU and the surrounding community of Hammond, America. Southern Louisiana is picking up the pieces after Hurricane Ida tore through a month ago, leaving catastrophic destruction in its wake, including here in Hammond. Mr. Mayor, tell us 30 days later, what's the situation here in Hammond? Uh, we're still struggling. Um, the most important thing, I think, for many people is getting electricity back. When you see something like this, a tree that looks predominantly healthy, being uprooted without police officers had their own chainsaws and they were clearing streets but citizens came out it was just incredible to see that it was a challenge neighbors a, helping neighbors uh, it's, it's a good an incredible it's, thing it's line up it, line up it's, that's, it's that's that, a, that's that spirit I'm, i mean that it's a wonderful community as you've seen there are some people that are okay but there are a lot of people that are displaced and a lot of people living in homes that they shouldn't have to be living in like courtney and benjamin williams along with their seven children who plan to ride out the storm in their three bedroom home. When the storm hit, can you tell us where you were in your house? What was going on? I was cooking and I heard move the kids. The tin from the church started slamming against the side of the house. It wasn't too long after that, the lights went out. So we all, I, I could literally hear tornadoes. All of a sudden it started flooding in our bedroom on us. And where are you living right now? Front room. Nine people. Yeah, just making it work. Now, rebuilders from the Fuller Center are lending a helping hand to support the Williams on the road to recovery. The family's belongings packed up in this storage container outside their home. We've taken out the ceiling, we've taken out the rooms, and we're going to build this all back for them, better than it was before. And you are here two, three years after. Here it is just a month after. It takes a long time. We come in after a major hurricane like this and we help people get back into their houses. The city of Hammond, also home to Southeastern Louisiana University, my beloved alma mater. The storm impacting the students like Kylie Dupree. We went to sleep thinking we were okay and then now we are restarting with just a mattress on the floor and we've lost everything. The women's basketball coach, Ayla Gazzardo, showed us inside what was once the team's practice court. So where are we right now? We are in the kinesiology building, uh, the hub of campus. As you can see, it looks a little bit different than it used to. What has it been like on campus when you see this type of destruction? It's devastating, but you know, you look at it and you think positive. Yeah, it's going to come back better. You step foot on campus and you feel loved, you feel welcomed. And that's, you know, that's Louisiana. It's Hammond, America. Get her the ball! Get her the ball! Give her the ball! Give her the ball. Give her the ball. And nowhere do you feel that love more than here at the University Center. The older I get, the better I was. Home of the Lions a place I know quite well. So how has it made you stronger? As a team, I would say it made us appreciate the time. You know, every day is a day that we have to take advantage of it. We didn't know when we were coming back to campus, but we knew we needed to get out in the community. We were cutting up branches, moving them, hauling them to the road, uh, passing out food, water, different types of things like that. If we can't play ball, we're gonna do something to better ourselves in our community. Yeah. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.